Well, my husband and I actually bought a treadmill just before lockdown. Uh, once the gyms all closed and stuff, we decided that the best thing was to try and get a treadmill rather than try and road run and go out and things. Obviously, with the two kids, it's a bit more difficult. So, yeah, that's uh, that's keeping us busy at the moment. I'm doing some sort of online uh, classes as well, some strength stuff and hit workouts. So, yeah, I'm keeping myself active as much as I can. Exercise is a big part of that. Um, you know, both in terms of trying to stay fit enough for football purposes, but also getting out and walking with my family. Uh, we found some nice little walks around where we live. So we go out, the four of us, most days and, and try and get a good hour or so in all together where we're not looking at phones or iPads or anything like that and just, you know, talking. The weather helps, obviously, with it being nice and sunny. Um, so the long walks get a little bit longer when it's nicer weather. So, yeah, just generally trying to keep active and trying not to watch too much news you know you want to be in the know but you don't want to know too much and you know there's so much uncertainty you can you can take in too much so yeah just the sort of things that I think most people are doing to be honest well um I probably have to ask my husband's permission first um but I wouldn't mind chilling out with Michael Owen and watching some of his uh, his goals that he scored over his career um every time somebody mentions a player that I looked up to as a kid, it was always him. I, I try and sort of mould my game around him, um, you know, off the shoulder of, of the last defender and scoring poachers goals and things like that. So yeah, we could go and watch all his YouTube videos together. Someone like Elise, because she eats so much, I don't think it'd be easy to keep her happy and keep her fed. I think she goes for about six bowls of cereal a day. To someone like that, or one of the younger ones that don't stop talking and, and are on all the time. So someone someone young and someone hungry, I just don't think I could cope with that. It's hard enough for my two kids that I have to look after. I wouldn't want us to look after one of the other younger ones that aren't my kids. I've signed up for an online sort of business type course. Just a very basic thing, just a sports business. Um, but I haven't actually started that. And... I should be brushing up on my Welsh, but again, I haven't got that far just yet, but I do have a book that is Welsh for beginners that I will be tucking into as soon as I can.